Wing Pro Series. It's gonna be exciting. Anytime you get a chance to play a PGA Tour quality course in PGA Tour quality playing condition, you jump on it. And when you get the opportunity to do that two days in a row, you make it count. People have been asking me what I do for health and fitness, how I stay fit in my 50s. Well, first off, I see a chiropractor every month just to get re, it's, it's more injury prevention than anything. And I just am diligent about doing that. So that's one thing. Two is every month lately, I do a three day fasting juice cleanse. So uh, that's, uh, today is day three of my juice only um, cleansing fast. And I've got uh, my juice right here with me breakfast so it does affect how I play unfortunately but afterwards I feel uh, great golfing today Matt but the goal today is stay under the hole fast Bermuda greens getting ready for the uh, tour championship and, uh, it's a gorgeous day a little overcast cooler it's gonna be great so here we go getting started on round one and using my V1 golf app just to record the scores and keep track of my stats and all that good stuff. And for the most part, I was hitting the ball pretty well. I was getting in the rough a little too often, which was deep and thick and very difficult to deal with. At the end of the day, I shot a 78. Not great, but I felt like, hey, if I can tighten up my approach shots to the green, hit a few more fairways, things will be good. All right, so good practice round like I'm trying to do the best I can obviously and was a little off hit some good shots putted pretty decently got to get used to those Bermuda greens I don't play on those very often and uh, it was great so now for tomorrow I have the lines I want to go I know the speed of the greens and I'm comfortable kind of with how the brakes are and just the you know setting up on each tee box hopefully Hopefully we'll just uh, be more comfortable and go from like five over par to my goal is to be even or one or, or under par, like right around there, one under, one over, even par. That would be my goal and that's what I would assume. And well, I don't know if that would qualify, but at a course like this, that would be kind of a good thing for me in my progression to becoming better and better. Okay, getting ready for round two. Now, uh, as you saw on my scorecard, I actually shot 78, and uh, all right, but that's fine. There, here are my plans to clean up, is three putts, get rid of those, because I know the greens now, so that's a goal. And I know kind of where to miss and where not to miss off the tee box, I think that's critical. And hopefully we hit more fairways. The big glaring issue were my approach shots in. I'm ready to rock, there's food in my system, and we're going. Now this is the, the round, right? The, what would be the qualifying round? Now East Lake's tough, and it's in tour condition. PGA tour condition, challenge. Tour championship condition, even more challenging. So it's a great test. Warming up at the range. And as luck would have it, we got Micah from Good Good Squad with George Bryan. And then some country music stars down there too. Uh, I'm not a country music guy. George Wallen or something, I don't even know. He's here too. Getting ready for round two. This will be the qualifying round. So feeling good, feeling refreshed. Got my own sticks in the bag. And look, look at this, as luck, go, I can't believe this small world playing right in front of me is Micah and George Bryan they're playing a little match right in front of us check it out look at these guys huh? getting their little match on talk to them in the uh, restaurant beforehand and we're playing right behind them so here we go round two and I did not get off to let's say the greatest start I could have hoped for and again I was missing some of the fairways and putts were very very difficult obviously we have new pins to deal with each and every day 
and I, I did feel comfortable, but at the same time, my swing, I would say, just wasn't clicking. And you would think after a practice round and then coming out to play a real round that things would kind of gel, but they didn't. It took me quite a while to get comfortable with my swing. And that's gonna happen from time to time. And putts were just not dropping. This was probably my best swing of the day, but again, it was 21 feet to the hole and two putts. And then even when I hit good shots, I was just off the fairway in the rough. And so it was hard to get them close to make a putt. As you can see, close, but no cigar. And a lot of bogeys, one birdie equals not good. If this is a qualifier, I did one worse than yesterday. So it's safe to say I would not have made it. Uh, but I felt like I played pretty well and I, I'm just a little bit off. I gotta tighten it all up and I think we're good. It was tough, like I wouldn't have made it, but fail now so you can succeed later. Anyways, hope you liked the video. Love you guys. See you soon.